Nicotinamide riboside is one of the best known NAD booster supplements and because it's so popular there are literally dozens of brands so how do you know which brand is quality in other words how do you know which brand of nicotinamide riboside actually contains the stated amount that's on its label fortunately we have some independent laboratory testing on these brands and that's what I'm going to show you in this video if you want to see the research on nicotinamide riboside and what the research results actually showed I've pinned all those videos to the top of the comments so go check that out after after you're done with this video. Now before we go any further, realize that there are different forms of nicotinamide riboside. There's nicotinamide chloride, there's nicotinamide malate, and several others. So what's the difference between them? Well, one of the big differences is that nicotinamide chloride is one of the most well-known studied forms, and you'll even see it mentioned on some of the supplement facts labels that I'm going to share with you in this video. Another thing, when the paperwork for the chloride form was submitted to the FDA, for being generally recognized as safe, the FDA didn't even bat an eye. Now that's not to say that the other forms of nicotinamide riboside are inferior, and by the time you see this video, there may be additional research papers on these other forms showing that they are equally as effective. Okay, so which are the brands that passed third-party independent testing? Well, let's begin with the analysis done by ConsumerLab.com. ConsumerLab tested three brands of nicotinamide riboside, and here are the brands that they approved. The first brand is called True Niagen. This is from a company called Chromagen now called Niagen Biosciences. When Consumer Lab tested the 300 milligram dose of True Niagen, they found that it actually contained 303 milligrams. Consumer Lab also tested the Life Extension Cell Regenerator Supplement, where one capsule was stated to have 300 milligrams of nicotinamide riboside, and Consumer Lab found that it contained 292. Consumer Lab also liked the Thorn brand. It's called Nicel. They tested the Nicel 200 brand, and it also passed However, when I checked, the Nicel 200 brand appears to have been discontinued, although stick a pin in that, we're going to come back to the Thorn brand in a second. Now let's take a look at the analysis done by Chromadex. Recall that Chromadex is the maker of True Niagen. They actually tested 39 different brands of nicotinamide riboside, and their results are quite different. So in 2025, Chromadex releases this result. They call it the Quantitative Analysis of Nicotinamide Riboside Consumer Products and Counterfeit True Niagen Products. And to make things easier, they provide this very handy pie chart where you can see that out of the 39 products tested, 29 of them actually failed, with 14 of these products containing less than 1% of the amount of nicotinamide riboside that's stated on their label. Overall, only five of the products tested contained levels of nicotinamide riboside that were at or above the amounts stipulated on their supplement facts label. First up on the approved brand list is the Elysium Basis Supplement. Two capsules of Elysium Basis are stated to have 250 milligrams of nicotinamide riboside. Chromadex found that it actually contained 251 milligrams. Next up is the Genuine Purity brand of nicotinamide riboside. Two capsules of the Purity brand were stated to have 300 milligrams of nicotinamide riboside. However, Chromadex testing revealed it had almost 500 milligrams. Just like with Consumer Lab, Chromadex also approved the Thorn brand of this supplement as well. Specifically, they approved two Thorn supplements. One's called Nicel 400, which actually contained 475 milligrams of nicotinamide riboside. And they also approved the Thorn Reservacell supplement as well. As you can see from this supplement facts label, the Reservacell supplement also has these additional ingredients too. Also approved Pro Base Nutrition Nicotinamide Riboside. One capsule was stated to have 500 milligrams. Testing revealed it actually had. 501 milligrams. And given all the research that actually has involved the True Niagen brand of nicotinamide riboside, it should also come as no surprise that Chromadex approved their 300 and 500 milligram dose of this supplement. However, if you go looking for the True Niagen 500 milligram dose supplement, it looks like it has been rebranded as True Niagen Pro 1000. Now, I consider this to be the same supplement because it takes two capsules to equal 1000 milligrams. In other words, each capsule has 500 milligrams. Now I just showed you an awful lot of supplements, so to make your shopping easier, here are all 
of the brands side by side so you can see them. And as you look at this table, pay special attention to the number of capsules you would have to take to achieve the stated dosage. And to help you further, see all my other videos on the research on nicotine on my riboside and other NAD boosters below. Don't forget to share this with your friends, and I'll see you in the next video.